good morning you guys okay so it is currently um hold on let me show you it's currently 3 52 in the morning we had to get up at 3 3 15 just so i could take daniel to work yesterday was christmas okay so yesterday was christmas and i will insert the clip of christmas um in just a second but today the kids the kids stayed with my grand with my grandparents last night um i've i'm gonna go back to the house box up this box that is supposed to go to ups usps and um huh, i gotta do that but before i head out i want to explain what happened let me let me shut the car off okay so what happened was they sat there and i i've been selling stuff on macari and if you guys want to go check out macari i will put the app link down below i think that's what it's called but anyways i've been selling scentsy stuff on there so if you want to order scentsy stuff from me off of there or whatever um that's perfectly fine but i paid for shipping um i paid for shipping when i was posting it and this woman puts my this woman put my box in a priority mailbox, knowing that the priority mailbox does not meet the tracking number with my other box. So then I had to go run around trying to get the tracking, try to get the tracking paper printed out again and blah, 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 blah. So now I'm going to have to put everything in another box, go print off this label once again and send it and then she also charged me at least and I say at least because it ranges at least 366 to four dollars for a flat envelope that didn't have any bumps or anything like that um to send off when I paid for the stamps I paid for the envelopes um so that's gonna be fun so I'm gonna go to a different USPS. I'll probably go to the one in um, Alexandria because I've got a baby doctor's appointment today. Uh, we're 29 weeks. 29 weeks and two days. So I have to go. I've been having a lot of pelvis pain the past couple of days. It's been to the point that like if I go to stand up or I go to move, my pelvis is just an, an aching pain. Like a lot of aching pain. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring it up to her, um, go to the post office, because I'm going to go back home and get some sleep. That's, that's just that. I'm going back home. But if I can go back to sleep. But anyways, I'm going to insert that clip right here, and you guys will see me again today. I just don't know <laughs> when, because I want to go home and go back to bed. But yeah, I will see you guys in a couple hours, I know that. All right. Yep, you gotta sit on your booty. Mommy, when Christmas comes again, of my kids and I'll get You can open them. You guys know what it is? Yeah. Mine is a, um, a tablet. Why don't you set it to the side and then Mine we'll... Mine is a tablet. Okay, set it to the side and we'll do... We'll open them last. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a next project. Yes, we're opening Okay, it. hold them real quick. Let me see what you guys got. They did it. They did it. They did it. They did it. They sure did. Mine is a tablet. Let me see your guys' faces, Goober Heads. Both of you guys. Yep. You guys have to share it with ever inside. I did it as a sharing Mom, opportunity. Do I have to, um, open it? Yeah, no, let your sister. Yeah, both of you are supposed to open it. It's a sharing opportunity. It's movies. Like my movies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should eventually wrap uh, <laughs> this. This one is yours, Aubrey. It's right there. 
Is this one of these mine? What's the video game? Mason, this is mine. Well, you guys get to share them. This one's a... Can Hold on. Can you open this? Not yet. Put it down. I didn't want another. I just wanted one. <laughs> you didn't want an actual stroller? I did. Oh, you did? It's It's got the uh, ties around it. Okay. I didn't want another one. Now I got two. I have all of the Lego games. Yes. One is in my Mr. head. Mr. 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 You got what? a remote control. A controller that connects to that. If I oh, yeah, you did, didn't you? Yeah, I wanted to. <laughs> Hobbs, do you want any more presents from Santa? I, I can't open that. My mind. Yours, Mason, and it. Okay, those are stamps, Obs. Don't open them right now. Wait till we get paper. This is mine. What's inside of it? Okay. Let's, let's open up some more presents, Obs, before you. All right, we'll fix it. Put oh, it together. Oh, that's my comb. Yeah, you got a new comb. Oh, really? That's your stuff. Yeah. Abs. I'm so Abs. My Look, you've got two other more presents. Candy. <laughs> huh? That's my candy. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to show my Did this Did you hear what she said? What? She was like, you said no more candy. <laughs> What'd you get? Oh, I got open it's a okay. It. A car? Yeah, a truck? Next, I got pop things. Pop things. Mommy, I read the ring. Can I have one of these? Did she just read that? Um, they they got long things. Oh. Pop ring. Well, it said pop on the front of it, so she was like, I got pop things. <laughs> Mommy, I, can, my I, can, I can read. Well, that's green, pop. green pop. I saw that. I got a new. What is it? It's my bus and my pony. You got one? Mommy, guess what? Alright, you got. Mommy, guess what? No, we got two. Mommy, guess oh. what? Mommy, guess what? Huh? It's mommy. What, baby? Um, I used to, I had one of these with the um, Light McQueen on it, and there was a circle. You did, didn't you? This is a new circle. Here. 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 You sure you aren't thinking about Mila? Because I'm pretty sure Mila got that too. I know. <laughs> I know. Mom, this real? That's not real. That's. Um, I don't open it. That's Oh, it's Chris's. Dancer and Donner. Dancer and Donner. You're right. That's who was on there. Yeah. You guys like what you got for Christmas? Yeah. It's my socket. My socket. My socket. <laughs> you see her face? Just my socket. Is it good? Do you love it? 
She is so me on Christmas. I love the presents, but I'm more concerned about the food. No, but I got this. Alright guys, so I am currently at my appointment. Um, I've actually got like 30 minutes. But I wanted to explain something. Um, so I left Daniel's job. And I didn't even make it like two miles down the road. And I got stopped. I only got a warning though. I'm not used to driving his car. Like I've drove it before, but it's not like my car. So I got a, um, I got a warning. I legitimately got, I'm trying not to show you guys any information, but I got a warning for no lights. Awesome, right? Awesome. So anyways, she gave me a warning and I'm like, okay, thank you, you know, because I don't ever have anything on my name. I've had one speeding ticket, but literally that speeding ticket was, um, it was a 55 and then that day the officer said like I, he knew I wouldn't have known, but that day, um, ever, okay, cause like we used to drive down to Corsi and in that one spot it was 35 miles or it was 55 miles. Well, not even like 15, 20 minutes before they put the sign there, or 15, 20 minutes after they put the sign there, I went through to 155 and didn't know that they switched it to 35. So he only got me for like four or five miles over the speed limit. But that was like two or three years ago. So I don't ever have anything on my name. But I was craving white castles so yes white castles for breakfast i got five sliders and six chicken rings and a coke this little boy is gonna make me so fat but anyways i'm gonna i'm gonna eat this and go into my appointment and i'm gonna talk to daniel while he's on break and i'll see you guys in a little bit all right, guys, so I am heading off. Um, I know you're sitting at a weird angle, but I just don't want to get pulled over or anything like that for having my phone out. But anyways, I'm going to update you guys on some stuff. So my last appointment, um, I was 27 weeks pregnant, and my doctor put me on a higher protein diet. Um that did not go over well i was like super shaky my stomach was upset um it was like i had a protein intolerance like this pregnancy i've gotten a protein intolerance well with that being said um my doctor that i seen when i was pregnant with mason uh, i think i might have seen her with aubrey i'm not exactly sure but she she said not to eat the protein eat what i can um you know, after, after Lex is here, then we'll discuss, we'll discuss, um, what my protein intolerance, why I have a protein intolerance pretty much. So, um, I know you guys can't really see me, but anyways, um, he's doing perfectly fine. He has a heartbeat of 135 and she said that, um, she said, even though he's given, he's like bigger than what his sisters are, or his brother and sister is, Mason and Aubrey, that he will be, he'll probably be about six to seven pounds. I don't think so. I, I personally don't think so. Like the size of Daniel's like weight and his siblings and him and everything. I don't, I don't think so, but we'll see when he's born. All right, guys. So I took Daniel his lunch. I was in Walmart for like an hour and a half. Didn't plan on that. And I'm hot and I'm sweaty. Okay, so the door is currently open because I cannot get, I cannot manhandle that Christmas tree. So, um, <laughs> I gotta wait for him to get out here to move the Christmas tree over because my stomach was starting to cramp. But I got the Christmas tree and like 
everything that we got for 50% off. I could have got it for 60% off, but I there was a woman ahead of me, and I used the discount on her card. I used Daniel's Walmart discount on her order and gave her 10% off, and then it wouldn't let me do it back to back on my art my order so I didn't get 60% off but I got the 50% off so it's okay but there will be a Walmart haul video Christmas haul um coming soon I'm out of breath Daniel needs Daniel's got like 30 minutes till he gets off of work and then we have to go get our Tdap shots and then over to oh god and then over to the house to drop everything off to then go get the kids. All right guys, so I need to finish this vlog so much. It's been like almost a week. No, it's been a week since I went Christmas shopping and everything has been sitting on my living room floor. Just trying to find totes to put it in and life has been going on. I haven't felt the best this pregnancy and here I am almost 31 weeks. So I'm going to show you what I have on the table that's Christmas that I bought on the 50% off sale. Then I'm going to show you what's on the floor. That way I can get it put up. I'm out of breath. So let me move this because that's got important people's real life, right? Kids and Scentsy and everything going on in my breakfast this morning and toys but this is one of the ones I got it is a nativity scene I'm trying to show you I don't know if you can it lights up guys it lights up so I got that it came out to like three or four dollars I think three or four dollars and this was the, yeah, we're still unpacking. But this is what, this was the ultimate reason why I went was because there's a Christmas tree and I'm not going to flip it, but we got a, oh, I don't even know the size, a seven foot tree, 400, let me show you, 400, I don't know if you guys can see it, but. Seven foot tree height, 400 pretty strong multicolor mini lights, um, four foot diameter, bulb stay lit if one bulb burns out. So we got that one. This, the tree came out to like 40 bucks. That was a blessing. And uh, I was going to use Daniel's discount to get like 60% off, but I used it on a woman in front of me. To help to bless her during Christmas season. So that, we didn't get that. But then, I don't even remember what each and everything came out to. I just know that it was 50% off and the total came out to $226.48. and I think it was 48 cents. So it would have been double that originally. And then I got, I got the Christmas tree light, the Christmas tree star, pregnancy brain, light up the tree topper. And this should have a price. Okay, there's no price on this. But I got that too. Now let me show you everything that's on the floor. That's just going to have to do. Okay, so as I face everything, I got clothes and everything on the floor over here from unpacking. All of it. All of it. All of it. Okay, so I'm going to go what's in order by around me. So I showed you all the stuff that's over there. But we got, some of this does have the price on it. And then, um, I'm not going to do the math on each one. But we've got, okay, so you guys don't know, but um, Ronnie got hit by a car on the 20th, the day before Daniel's birthday. So we saw this cute little um, playful puppy blow up 
three and a half foot little um, like outside inflatable and it looked it it doesn't look just like him but it, it looked like him in the scent and this came out to this was originally $14.98 so half of that is what we paid for this one and I can't wait to blow these up this year well yeah this year because it's a new year as I film this I'm sorry guys I'm so sorry today's the second and I'm doing this video when it was supposed to be done like the day after Christmas Okay, so next, because Daniel is a Mickey Mouse fanatic, we got the energy efficient LED uh, match, I don't know, match this letter I-12 or something, I don't know, but it's a Mickey Mouse air blown inflatable five foot, so as tall as me, Mickey Mouse, originally $28.84, came out to $24, no, like... 1444 or something like that. But this is it. And he lights up. So that's what we got. There is a decoration piece outside. It says, um, I'll insert a picture right here. But it's a concrete piece. And we have it over the outlet box. That way when we plug in everything, it will cover the outlet box and keep the kids from playing with it. Because next year we'll have Lex that will be toddling outside too. So, there's that. And then Daniel. I love him so much. But him with gift bags is like me with cooking stuff. So he got, these were all half off. These were two fifty four dollars a piece. So he got... Four Christmas bags that say let it snow with um, Santa and the penguin and I think he likes Christmas like he likes gift bags and I love them too but I think the reason why he likes these so much is because he's horrible at wrapping presents so gift bags is the way to go with him plus you can reuse them but he got four of them and then we also got this is me guys this is me so I'll show you, I'll show you these last because I gotta find all of them. And you'll laugh at me. But I got a this was originally 98 cents. And it's it goes in the ground and it says, Santa, please stop here. So that'd be cute next year. The little wood steak. And then because we have the hill, because this is the house that my grandparents built. We have a hill right here, the flood wall, that is perfect for sledding down. So, this is the stakes for the ground, or you can hang it up on the wall, either or. But, this one don't have the price on it, but it says, Old Fashioned Sleigh Ride, 25 cents. So, that is like, that is like adorable. Ain't it adorable? I love, I love this sign. I absolutely adore this sign. It is so cute. But you can hang it up, and that's what I'll probably do is I'll probably hang it up by the door over there to the other part of the ha um, porch. And or you can you can just like stick them in there and hang it up or stick it in the ground. So that's something else that we got. And then Daniel got not everything matches, but it, it's okay. Daniel got a 56 inch tree skirt. I don't know. Let me see if I can find the price. Okay, it don't say. But this is the tree skirt to go around the tree for next year. <laughs> what is this? More of what I'm going to show you last because you guys will laugh at me. You guys are still going to laugh. It's so funny. What's in this bag? Oh, and then because I love decorating the porch, like we have a wraparound porch, so it doesn't go all the way around. So, so it's like a 85% wraparound porch, but we've got some lights, 19.6 um, feet, um, feet 
lights, 240 LED, indoor, outdoor use. And these don't have a price on them originally, or original price, but that's what we got. We got red. And then we've got, we might put these on the tree. See, like me and Daniel, we like the pre, we don't like the pre-lit tree because we like to decorate it, but at the same time, it's so much, e it's like easier. And then there's not that many strands that we have to deal with. And I don't know, call me crazy. I love decorating the tree from like beginning to end without the Christmas lights on it. That's how I was raised. But we got, I mean, like they had so many of them and we just, we picked. But so we got the 100 uh, multicolor mini lights for the tree or for the porch or for around the house to hang up, however we want to do it. So there's that. What is this? Oh, and then um, Daniel's favorite color is red, and I thought these were super cute. But it's a four-piece lights or lights ornaments, and these do not have a price on them originally. I wish I had the receipt as to Daniel has the receipt, so that's not gonna do <laughs> for prices. And then I thought of Aubrey with these, because she's like the only girl. And when Lex is here, she'll be the only girl unless we have another one. But these are absolutely cute. They're ornaments. We got tinsel garland purple. I like purple. I know you love purple, huh? And pink. Purple and pink. And then, Daniel thinks I'm absolutely crazy because I adore... I adore like these fake little trees and these little pots, but this one says joy and peace, and it's so cute. Put it on the table, put it on the mini table. Mommy, that's beautiful. These? That's the cheese ice cream. I know, these are for the Christmas tree next year when we hang it up. Okay. Told you. <laughs> she spotted them. She spotted them. <laughs> she spotted them. Okay, let me move some of these And then, Daniel picked these because they're super cute. But these are the ornaments. They're like a bright neon. Kind of like a dim, but bright neon. Um, there's 41 shatterproof ornaments. Kids and then an infant, almost toddler. Are there for kids? These are for the Christmas tree. They're ornaments for the Christmas tree. But there's okay. green and blue and what colors are in there? Ops? Purple. Zeta. That's green. Wait, this is Zeta. That's green. Zeta. Green. This is green. That's Zeta. That's the same color. Here, what color? Where's the blue? I got. Where's red. the blue? Blue. Good job. All right, go play so I can finish this up, okay? And then this one I thought was two different ones. I thought this was two different ones, but. It's not. It's one, and I, I think it's cute. I don't know where I'm going to hang it, though, but I'm, I'll find a place. Um, this one, I'll have a price on it either. But it's it's got the it's got the town of Bethlehem. And then it's got Jesus and Mary and Joseph, which I absolutely love as a Christian. And it says, Glory to the newborn king. Oh, it's so cute. And I love how, like, it's off-centered. As much as I have OCD, I love, like, decorations that are off. And then going on to the lights, <laughs> we have a 500 feet white LED um, cool white lights. So that's what we've got. Two. And then I have to find, I couldn't find the kids' as much, um, letters because I mean I got there like two or no I got there like what time did I get there it was after my appointment but I found an ornament with the letter D on it so I thought that was like absolutely adorable so it's like a three in one me Daniel and then Daniel Alexander little Daniel and then I just have to find one with an A and I have to find one with an M for Mason and Obbs so there's one ornament. I got a pre-lit pine garland. Daniel hates garland. I learned now while we were shopping that he hates garland. 
But I got a pre-lit garland. I think it'd be absolutely cute to hang up over there next Christmas because I like, I am a fanatic about Christmas. And the kids are arguing and screaming and fighting. So, and tell me if you guys think this is pretty. Daniel doesn't like it at all, like at all. But I think, I think it's absolutely beautiful. I don't want it to rip on the Christmas bag. Or on the bag. The store bag. This one don't have a... Yeah, so this was originally $6.98. But it just... It's a tabletop decoration. It's, it says decor. Decor decoration. But I absolutely love it. It's so pretty. And he thinks I'm crazy because I like things with the frost. Like the snow frost on it. I don't know. I I think it's so beautiful. Like it's got the little it's got the little pine cones and then like I guess like these like I guess they're like um like snowballs that, that they put on here. I mean it's fake, but but it's just it's so pretty. So pretty. Who is this one for? This is a stocking. This one's Mason's for next year. I think. I'm pretty sure it's Mason's. I don't remember how Daniel picked them for the boys. And then we've got the white lights that match the red. Holiday time. Oh, yeah, this goes on the door. Where am I at? 15. Okay, so I have to hurry and wrap this up. But here's a little snowman that goes on, side, on the door. I plan on getting married this year. I got a little ornament that says together. Together, better together, and it's a bride and groom. I got Aubrey, little, um, the little girl reindeer ears, and then I've got an October for Aubrey. It's a moose, it's her birthstone color, and then I got the blue garland tinsel, tinsel, tinsel garland. And then I got the blue, the blue ornaments. And then these would be fun for the kids next year. So it would be like his actual first Christmas. So we'll be putting his footprints on these. But the kids can decorate them. They're just the glass ornaments that you like paint, glitter, however you want to do it. So that'll be a fun project this coming year. This one I picked for Mason. Superheroes. Awesome, right? And then, because it's Lex's first Christmas, it says baby's first Christmas with the little stocking that goes to it. And then we got a set of, like, towels, dish towels. So these were three forty eight half off. So we got... Let's be jolly with the snowman. And then we got like a plaited one. Flannel. I have, this one's OBS. It says happy holidays. And it's it's a little unicorn stocking that she's going to absolutely adore. The kids haven't seen really any of like their personal stuff. Now, on to the last thing that you guys think I'm going to be crazy about. But it, I have one. Two, three, four sets of Christmas cards. So what I like to do with these is I like to have, like, not all set and different, but if anybody needs Christmas cards, I like to give them out. I have them for multiple years down the road. Um, I mean, like, I have a total of four years together right here, right here, right here. So um, I can either... I can either have one set for my Scentsy customers to send out their Christmas cards. I have one set for family in the church. Um, or however the case may be. So that's like two years. Two years together. However. But um, I'm going to go ahead and edit this video and get it up for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and give us a big thumbs up. And if you guys like this video really definitely subscribe my 2020 goal is to reach 1000 subscribers so 
Make sure you subscribe. All right, I gotta deal with kids. Bye.